Hello everyone, I'm Professor Ricardo. In this video, we are going to use the Euler-Lagrange equation to find the equation of motion of a forced harmonic oscillator. Find the equation of motion for a forced harmonic oscillator with the Lagrangian 1 over 2 m x dot squared minus 1 over 2 m omega squared x squared plus alpha x, where alpha is a constant. We are going to follow the same procedure we used in, a, in previous problems. For instance, this, for this one, to solve the equation of motion for a particle in one dimension, and for this one, for the harmonic oscillator. This is the Euler-Lagrange equation that we are going to solve, and this is the Lagrangian function, kinetic energy minus the potential energy. It is clear that the only coordinate of this system is x, so, instead of Q, we are going to use X. And the Euler-Lagrange equation that we need to solve is this one. Okay, so, uh, since we already get the Lagrangian, let's calculate the rel relevant derivatives. Del L del X dot, the derivative of this function with respect to X dot, is 1 over 2 M 2 times X dot, which is equal to M X dot but we need the total time derivative of this result. And it is equal to m x two dots. What about the partial derivative of the Lagrangian with respect to x? This is minus 1 over 2 m omega squared times 2x, which results in minus m omega squared x plus alpha. Using this result into the Euler-Lagrange equation, we get m x2 dots plus m omega squared x minus alpha equals zero. If we divide this equation by m, we obtain the second order derivative of x with respect to time plus omega squared x equals alpha over m. And this is the familiar equation of motion of a forced harmonic oscillator.